Designer and niche fragrances. Smell like sex and luxury. Hi, welcome to or welcome back to the channel, whatever the case may be for you. If you're new here, hi, I'm Damien. And today what we are doing is not a reaction. You may have looked at my channel and thought, hey, this is a reaction channel. But uh, today it, it is not. Today we are looking at a fragrance. Yes, we are examining a fragrance today. So uh, not too long ago, I, uh, you know, I discovered this fragrance by Killian called Black Phantom. And the presentation on it was what caught me. It, well, of course, the name and the presentation, like, the, it's just... It's amazing, you know, the, the box that it comes in, the, the detail, the skull, of course, just everything about it is just beautiful. Um, the price tag that comes along with it, of course, was not beautiful. Um, I guess to rich people, maybe it's okay, but I'm not a rich person. So, uh, naturally, I could not afford to get this beautiful presentation. And especially given the, the size bottle, the the amount you, you of, of, of actual fragrance that you get... You know, the price per mil, it's, it's just astronomical. But then again, you know, a lot of it, I think, is more based on the name and presentation than anything price-wise. But I was able to get my hands on a an official, like, little tester vial. I don't know if you can see this. This is, if it'll focus, it's Black Phantom. Wait, get behind there. Yeah. There we go. Black Phantom by Killian. You can see there's not much left, but uh, when I first sprayed this on, I am not even going to lie to you. Like the note breakdown, when you see the note breakdown, it sounds like just Goramond heaven. Let me, uh, let me go ahead and pull that up real quick. So I'm going to go to my favorite site which is fragrantica.com um, I'll link my profile in there if you guys want to go check it out and like talk fragrances with me um, but yeah so fragrantica is awesome because you can set up a profile list you know show pictures and list of, of what fragrances you have what you've had what you want what you have to test um, you can do pictures like on Instagram um, you can leave reviews on on things you can read other people's reviews you can interact with other people it's just it's a really cool site um, but so black phantom by Killian the notes dark chocolate rum caramel coffee sugarcane almond sandalwood and heliotrope sounds amazing right um, spoiler it is but the first time I smelled it, the first time I sprayed this on my skin, ooh, let me tell you, I was not a fan. Like, something about it just did not sit right with me. I was very upset. Um, you know, I gave it a few minutes to dry down, and even then I was just like, ugh, like, what? what is this? This is trash. I immediately went to the bathroom and scrubbed with two different kinds of soap, trying to get it off my wrist. I could not get the smell to come off. It was upsetting me so much. I just, I did not want to wear it. I wanted to put something else on. Couldn't get the smell to go away. So, put it on the back burner. I was like, okay, I can take that off my list. Even though the presentation's amazing, it's something, it's not something that I particularly will ever wear. So, I don't even care to, to own it. You know, initially it was one of those, you know, maybe I'll save up. Maybe one day someone will get it for me as a present. Somehow, maybe one day I'll acquire it, but... After smelling it, I was like, my mind was quickly changed. Well, fast forward a couple of months. I'm looking at it. You know, got this little vial. Uh, you know, I'm going through all my little tester vials. Because I, I order samples quite often. Just this, uh, like, higher end designer and niche fragrances. Just, you know, to see what if there's a lot of hype around them. Like, I want to see what the hype's about. Or if it just sounds interesting or if it has a cool presentation. If I like the way the note breakdown reads out and I want to smell it. You know, this is an affordable way to know if something is worth getting or not. But so yeah, fast forward a couple of months. I've, I'm, 
I've got this little thing laying around and I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna try that again. I sprayed it again and I didn't immediately go to smell it. I let it sit for a few minutes. And I was like, wait, what is that? And I go to smell it, you know, it's been, it's been there for about 15 minutes. And I'm like, oh Lord, what is this? Is good gracious. So I was blown away. I don't know what had, what changed in my whatever, but uh, I immediately fell in love. I was like, uh, this is going back on the list. Like I must have this. Um, well, yeah, of course, given the price point, it's something I'm not gonna be ordering anytime soon. Um, hopefully, maybe one day I'll receive it as a present. I don't know, but it's gonna be it's gonna be a long time before I can get it, and it's still hard to justify. The one thing that aside from the smell that's making me almost justify it is the fact that the presentation is so fucking cool like that kind of almost makes it worth it um but again not something that's gonna happen anytime soon but i wanted this smell and i didn't want to like have to order two or three more of these little things because these little things you know um i forget how much i paid for this it was between eight and twelve dollars it was either eight dollars or twelve dollars i can't remember but it's just like a little two mil sample you know and that's uh that's crazy um i didn't want to order spend that much on another one just to be able to wear it like one or two times so i i, I realized there were a couple of companies uh like alt fragrances who i've worked with before and alexandria fragrances who have made dupes of this well, I read the reviews for both both uh, companies uh, on on their dupes, and um, I was really liking what I was seeing from Alexandria. So I watched some other YouTubers' reviews on the Alexandria dupe for Black Phantom, and I pulled the trigger. I was like, you know what? I'm going to order it. You know, sixty something dollars compared to three hundred. You know, it's a it's a no brainer. Um, so. This this is the presentation that Alexandria Fragrances sends. This is here is the box. Alexandria Fragrances, you know, it's a sixty mil. This is, this is the top perfume extract, uh, handcrafted in California. You know, it's it's a it's a nice presentation. And then this is the actual bottle. You know, it's, uh, you've got Alexandria Fragrances. You've got their logo. you got their logo on top. And these, it's a nice wooden cap. Uh, you got the name of the fragrance on the side. This is, their version is called Dark Knight. Um, but I got to tell y'all, uh, I'm, I'm going to be 110%. This is a beautiful presentation. It's like heavy heavy blue glass bottle but i'm gonna be a hundred and ten percent honest with you um i the, the, i cannot tell the difference at all not even a little bit not even a subtle like anything even when the in the opening like a lot of dupes um i've noticed this with like uh you know uh, a couple of, of things from alt fragrances um the initial spray it's like if you if you go one to one you know sometimes like with certain ones you can kind of tell you're like oh okay there's a slight difference in the opening but after it dries down for about five minutes you're like oh okay it's a lot harder to tell them apart with the opening of black phantom by killian and the opening of dark knight by alexandria i absolutely cannot tell the difference and the long the the dry down the the everything about it like through the entire course of the fragrance i cannot tell a difference at all this smells to me 100 percent identical to black phantom and i'm loving that um because until i can afford to get black phantom i can get this and also um i won't have to like worry about going through black phantom when i do get it because i've got this so i can just kind of hold on to black phantom as a collector and when i want that delicious 
gourmand chocolatey coffee smell. I've got this. I can wear this. You know, it's just like I'm gonna I'm gonna do the the thing again. So I'm gonna spray Killian Black Phantom on my right wrist, and I'm gonna spray Alexandria on my left wrist. Oof, it's a good sprayer. Nice little atomizer going on. Um, let me try to put it back in the box. Oh god! Oh god! My god! I, I, no one. I can't see how anyone would be able to tell the difference between these two. I mean, your nose. I mean, I feel like. Part of me, you know, I, I want to say, uh, you know, oh, naturally Killian's better. You know, uh, the juice is, is better quality because it's Killian. I can't honestly say that. I can't tell if the quality is better or not because to me they're identical. Um, I wore Alexandria fragrance to Dark Knight to work the other night. And the performance was just absolutely stellar. The longevity, the projection, everything about it. I mean, it's just absolutely gorgeous. It's very sweet, yummy. Uh, you know, like I said, it's the, the dark chocolate, the coffee, the sugar, the almond. It's just unbelievable. Um, I don't know why I wasn't in love with it the first time I smelled it. But I am in love with it now and I, I don't foresee that changing any time in the future ever um so yeah yeah that's uh that's about all i got for that uh i just wanted to share that with you because i love fragrances and i want to do uh more fragrance content on this channel um but also if you are not subscribed and you want more fragrance videos fra what if you're not subscribed and you want more fragrance reviews or just information about fragrances or fragrance list or any other fragrance content that I do uh, drop a like on the video let me know in the comments that you'd like to see more stuff like this and uh, subscribe to the channel because it's free and it just helps me grow and um, there will be links in the descriptions for ways uh, you can get stuff from alt fragrances using my coupon code and ways you can help me feed my cats if you're interested in love cats like I do, uh, you know, cats and fragrances are like my two favorite things. But uh, in the meantime, I gotta go. <laughs>